Croatia's first round. Uh, I think like we had some struggles, but I, th I think we can get, get better. So like we have like two days off, so I think we can like learn from this from this group, from this stage. So like, I think like solid, solid. How do you like to hear about it? Uh, it's amazing. Like, the feeling is good. Like to be a young kid just to came in like to play for Croatia, it's like a really, really good feeling. Now going uh, to Berlin, yeah. heading to Berlin. Uh, to give like, of course, like we're trying to get like most out of it. So like we're like aiming for the highest place, of course. But like we will see like from game to game. So tell me about your summer. You've been selected in the second round uh, right. for the Pelicans. Yeah. Which are your plans? Uh, right now I'm with the Serbia Olympia. I'll play like for a year. We will see like hopefully like healthy season and good. So we will see afterwards probably. Over. You also made the summer league. Uh, yeah, yeah, I was summer league. I played only one game and then yeah. uh, I got injured, so uh, I didn't play the rest of it. But it was a like, really, really nice experience. Like Pelicans organization, I really, really like. It was really great. Like experience there. Like, I felt like family there, right? So like, yeah, it was really good. How long did you feel? Uh, okay, watching Bosnia right now okay. and the problems they're facing okay. in the Euro basket. Do you feel a little bit vindicated for making this decision to play for Croatia? Uh, what I would say vindicated. Like, listen, uh, first first time like when I played for them, it was like uh, not that I had to, but the contract I had when I uh, transferred from uh, my home city in Livno to Zagreb, we had to give something to the, to the national team, right? So we like, gave the contract, so I will play for them for like uh, from 21. And uh, after that I finished, uh, after that I finished, I went uh, for Croatia because like my my whole my, my, like, family is Croatian, just because you know ex Yugoslavia split yeah, up, of course, you know. So like, like, but the problems they're facing, it's not like really nice to see, you know. Like, of course, like you feel like a little bit sad. But, not just for Bosnia, for any other team because they have quality. So you saw what Dorkin said. Uh, yeah, about four players. No, I, I, I will get into that. You know, so like, I don't know, like the real situation, mm. but like I can feel like a little bit sad. Did you like, experience like, similar problems when you were there? Uh, when I was like in U18. Yeah, Bosnia. Uh, not really. Not really. Not really. It was the situation was alright, and the team was like the team was really good. Like we had really like good fun. So, like, we, we went to the B division, mm. but like the experience was really good with the coaches and everything. Like we felt like family. So like, hello, yeah. hello. tell me about uh, uh, perpetuating uh, this tradition of Croatian bigs. We've seen the uh, Randall is standing the Croatian federation right now. Uh, there's many okay uh, uh, players in the NBA right now like Darius Saric and Chota Dubac also. Yeah. How uh, are they mentoring you? Uh, how are they mentoring you? Yeah. Like us? Uh, I don't know. Right? Like, are they giving you advice? I mean. Look, they're like giving me advice like where to be, how to like get myself in the space, like uh, how to protect the rim, how to finish around the rim, like some stuff like I can't really explain it in English, but like yeah. a lot of stuff when we play to five and five, then I do something they'll be like, Yeah, do this and this, like it's better for you, easier. So like it's a really good like mentor. And Carlo, it's your first year of basket with Croatia. How's the experience been for you? Well, amazing, amazing, like I appreciate the coach for calling me because I'm a young kid still. Like we had uh, uh you know, and uh, for me it's really like amazing, like good experience, like first time, like big stage. So yeah, it felt really good. And we know you're going to be playing with Sevilla this year. We get to watch it in ABA. Uh, have you been talking to the Pels though at all? Have they been watching you or? Uh, yeah, they've been watching us uh, for the first two games. Uh, I was with them with the coach, so uh, it was like. They, they take care of you, you know, like that. They're gonna like look look me through the season. So um, yeah, like, of course. well, like, you know, it must be really great for you to get a, a start to a season like this, like playing Eurobasket, playing with such great talent. Uh, right, right. You'll get like the the feeling of the game quicker, you know. Like I didn't like stop this whole summer, like from the last year till this year. So like uh, I'm like in the most the whole year. So like I didn't even like. Well, enjoy your two days off for the game. Let's say enjoy your two days off and good yeah, luck in Berlin. Thing. How did the uh, 